The creation of the GoPro permanently altered what could be shot and how it's filmed. Since the invention of the GoPro, filmmakers from all over the world have been able to record footage that was previously off-limits. These are the scariest things ever captured on a GoPro camera. Fair Attacks I've always been curious as to why individuals use GoPro cameras when mountain biking in remote areas. Although the video is frequently so shaky it doesn't really make for fantastic watching, now I understand. They might want to revisit it later. When a bear hunts them down and kills them, they want to have proof of how they perished. There is too much video online of cyclists trying to move as quickly as they can to avoid bears, with survival being the main driver. A dog monkey creature When there were no excellent cameras, we had to narrate stories from memory and rely on others to believe us. Most people may not have believed what we experienced since it was so unreal. Well, one gentleman managed to photograph something very bizarre. So you don't have to guess if it truly happened, only what the monster was. A rider had made the decision to test drive his bicycle while carrying a camera along a narrow lane by his village. Something grey sprang down from a wall and nearly fell on him as he cycled down en route at high speed. He initially mistook it for a dog, but later, after seeing the video, he learned that he thought was a dog was actually some kind of dog monkey monster that was about the same size as his bike. He still hasn't been able to identify it and the internet isn't much better. Escaping from a shark Not everything you see on GoPro cameras is real, which is a concern when watching footage of activities that should never have been seen. A man who was employed by a Melbourne business that had obtained funding from Screen Australia recorded himself jumping off Jump Rock at Collins Beach a well-known jump location in Manly. His companions cry shark as soon as he jumps into the ocean wearing a GoPro and he hurriedly makes his way back to land. He is swimming with his head underwater when he encounters a great white shark. As you watch it, you can almost sense the dread that he must have had. However, it never occurred. Yes, the man did in fact dive into the ocean, but he edited the shark footage into his video. That does not mean that it cannot happen, though. In Australia, there were 22 unprovoked shark attacks in 2020, accounting for more than 38% of the total globally. Suspicious Owls Owls are fascinating tiny animals and we don't frequently get to observe them in their natural habitat. But using a GoPro, wildlife photographer Megan Lorenz was able to get some amazing and entertaining footage. On her yard in front of her house, Megan installed a GoPro camera. The camera caught two owls standing suspiciously in front of the camera as she left her property, one of which appeared to be bobbing its head to music that only it could hear. Due to their inability to move their eyes independently, owls actually bob their heads to better understand the depth of whatever they're looking at. The owl was most likely doing this action. The two owls stared at the camera for a while until the more inquisitive one finally approached it. The video with the background music was so expertly produced that it was utilized in a GoPro advertisement. Mountain Pass Drift GoPros can be used for crazy adventures as well as capturing strange creatures, allowing people who would never engage in certain activities to experience what it's really like. For instance, while most people won't have the chance to do so, you can watch footage of just that on YouTube thanks to GoPro. Frederick Ospo shared a video of himself operating his two Jay-Z Speed Hunters Toyota 86X with 800 horsepower across a Norwegian mountain pass. While most people would find it extremely difficult to drive up such a steep slope in a typical vehicle, this one manages to do it without any trouble, even passing another vehicle as if it was barely moving. He participates in Formula Drift contests where he won the global title in 2021. Even more impressively, this gifted man holds the record for the most victories in the history of the series. Backflip over a 72-foot canyon I'm not sure about you, but just seeing Kelly McGarry backflip over a 72-foot canyon and ride his bike on some very treacherous terrain left me fatigued. The clip was shot by Kelly at the 2013 Red Bull Rampage, a mountain bike race held close to Utah's Zion National Park. Due to the fact that attendance is by invitation only, this free ride event attracts some of the greatest competitors from across the globe. He traveled through curvy lines and down some very steep sections of track. Pro freeride mountain biker and X Games competitor Kelly McGarry was well known in the sport. He was from New Zealand. Sadly, he passed away in 2016 from complications from a cardiac arrest he had while cycling uphill on the Queenstown, New Zealand's Fernhill Loop Trail. When he passed away, he was just 33 years old. Stuck in a cave 
To appreciate caving as a pastime, you must be an adventurous, fearless sort of person. You could find yourself underground in some really dangerous situations, attempting to fight off the fear that you might become stranded and perish. One individual probably has the most experience with that emotion. A video of a caver getting his foot caught in a small rock tunnel within Lost John's Cave in Lancashire, Northern England, was published on YouTube. In a typical cave, it may not be a big deal, but this one was rapidly filling with water, and the man risked drowning if he couldn't get his foot untangled. As he was trapped within the cave, his companion caveman's GoPro captured the entire incident. He appears to be frightened, and even the most seasoned caveman would feel fear when realizing their lives may end at any moment. But it's obvious that it wasn't what happened because the video was posted online. Fortunately, the individual who submitted it stated that it was their worst caving experience and that they spent three hours climbing out of the cave in a different way. A Thieving Seagull Your friends and relatives definitely wouldn't believe you if you told them a bird snatched your camera. After all, seagulls are opportunists rather than thieves. It seems that a seagull in Spain's CA area swooped in on a GoPro when it discovered it unguarded. It swiftly takes up the camera, whether it believed it was food is unknown. When the seagull flies away, it helps the camera owners by physically capturing some incredible bird's eye view video. Then it does something that's probably unexpected. The camera is returned to its owners when the seagull lands back on land with it. Now that we have the video, they can show their loved ones that it really did happen and appreciate it for all time. GoPro itself took the video and posted it to its YouTube channel. Air Traveling No one was meant to watch this clip since there was a chance it would never be located. Get ready for a mind-blowing experience. In 2013, an eight-person light passenger jet operated by Makani Kai Air lost power and fell into the ocean. A passenger on board recorded everything with a GoPro camera, including the alarm that went off and the aircraft beginning to fall into the ocean. You can observe how everything transpired, including how everyone quietly exited the plane as it filled with water after grabbing a life vest. No one could even be heard screaming. Strangely, everyone was at peace. Even as he gripped the wing of the plane, the man with the GoPro continued to record. While it finally sinks, you can see everyone in the water bob. Everyone seemed to have made it through the disaster unharmed. Hang gliding Have you ever considered hang gliding? As you're about to learn, it could be best to go on to something else because it might turn you off. Chris Gursky from Florida wanted to go hang gliding while on vacation in Switzerland with his wife. He was able to capture the entire event on his GoPro, which is fortunate for him since it ensures he will never forget it. Unfortunately, during the pre-flight setup, the pilot that was accompanying him had neglected to secure him to the glider, and as they took to the air, they immediately realized their mistake. The issue was that there was no quick and secure way down once they were up. Chris, who was hanging onto the glider for dear life as they were climbing higher and higher, also tries to hang on to the pilot, literally, but it's difficult. The pilot tries to fly with one hand and hold on to Chris's harness while attempting a speedy and secure landing. Chris slips off as they approach near to landing, but he lives. He fractured his right wrist distal radius, necessitating surgery to insert a titanium plate and seven screws. He held on for so long that he tore the tendon in his left bicep as well. Sadly, it was his first day of vacation. Final hours recorded at sea The idea of having to wait till you pass away is the most awful thing I can imagine. About 30 miles off the Australian coast, Jacob Childs was diving with a group when he unintentionally became separated from them. Jacob swam in the direction he believed he ought to be swimming, but quickly realized he was disoriented and had no clue where he needed to be. After spending six hours by himself in the water, Jacob made the decision to record what he believed to be his last moments because the sun was beginning to set. He recorded himself as he floated in the water with his emergency flotation gear and eye protection. But just in time, a jet flies by, allowing rescuers to find him thanks to his flotation device. He's grateful that he was wearing his wetsuit since it prevented him from developing hypothermia. Other than being thirsty, he was largely well. Rock Climbing White Mountain in China while most climbers can climb rock faces and walls with ease in the United States in well-known locations like Yosemite, climbing such walls in China is a bit more difficult, and most are untouched due to Chinese government restrictions. It's only been in the last 20 years that climbing started to gain a following there as well. However, everything changed for this dynamic couple, Liu Yongbang and Xiao Ting. In 2018, they were also given the chance to climb White Mountain in China. 
The route known as Hot Dumpling is one of the most difficult climbing routes of White Mountain in Yangshuo, but they manage it with such calmness and precision. If you've ever considered rock climbing yourself, you can watch Lul and Zhao's incredible footage to determine if it's for you. Biking on Rooftops One man with a GoPro on his head chose to bike on roofs since it wasn't tough enough to ride on treacherous dirt paths. Danny McCaskill, a legend in Scottish trial cycling, is that person, and he made the decision to ride through the homes, roofs and other buildings in Gran Canaria, Spain. Danny rides as if it's no big thing to be one lost tire away from extinction while well, most of us would never even dare. He hops across buildings with a space between them that would almost surely result in a dive if you dropped while riding along the thinnest walls. Danny said to GoPro that he selected Gran Canaria as his destination because he wanted to go somewhere pleasant and sunny. Not in Scotland, unfortunately. He also needed good level rooftops so he could easily ride along them and openings in the buildings so he could leap over them. Additionally, Danny claimed that despite being on three- and four-story drops to his side, he was entirely at ease. A Shotgun Balloon Drop Even when partnered with an experienced professional who's done it hundreds of times, many people still have anxiety over the prospect of skydiving. Therefore, picture yourself flying back to Earth after feeling at ease reclining in a lawn chair tied to 90 weather balloons. GoPro athlete Eric Rohner floated into the air with a shotgun while sitting on his chair that had all the weather balloons connected to it. He began exploding the balloons after he got to the proper altitude, which was around 8,000 frightening feet in the air, so that they were freed from his chair and he could descend to the ground. I was certain he would perish when I saw those balloons take off, but when he landed, it appeared as though everything had gone according to plan. Big Cat Dentistry You don't get to see what it's like to do dental surgery unless you're a dentist. You've always been at the table when you do it, so you don't really know what's happening inside your mouth. However, seeing dental surgery on huge cats may be even more uncommon than seeing it on people. You could assume it doesn't happen until you see it with your own eyes. The same thing occurs at the Kevin Richardson Refuge in South Africa, and they record the entire process on a GoPro so you can watch how they do it. Giving these large animals root canals and potentially even extractions if the tooth is beyond salvaging is basically what they do with us. Helicopter Skydive The idea of leaping out of a helicopter or plane while wearing a backpack that's meant to unzip and drop a parachute to save your life is unsettling to many people. Who had this notion and why do they wish to pass away so much? But that's just one way of thinking. On the other end of the spectrum, there are some individuals who believe that skydiving is not nearly exciting enough and that they should do something even riskier. Three people made the decision to record it on GoPros and skydive in a unique way. When they got out of the chopper, they clambered out and hung on for a while before choosing to let go and drop to the ground. They then let go of their parachute and softly touched down on Florida's Navari Beach. When you view the video yourself, your mouth will be open in awe. A guy and a lady are on one side of the chopper, while another man holds on to the opposite side. The woman hangs off it as if she were some kind of monkey. Clearly, this is not their first experience. Rock Climb Base Jump Base jumping is when you jump off a stationary object and descend to the earth using a parachute. So you may use climbing gear to ascend a sheer rock face, reach the summit, and then quickly descend. Videos of base jumpers can be seen all over the internet, and one such video on YouTube has a man by the name of Zach scaling the monkey face rock in Oregon. He climbed to the top, leapt off, and then safely descended to the earth by gliding. The video was released by GoPro, and they also have videos of individuals scaling a monolith in France that rises over 30 floors, as well as one of a man in a wingsuit circumnavigating mountains in Switzerland. How fortunate some of these folks were to get the footage they did is beyond belief. It's time for the unusual subject now. The video shows a bizarre monster-like thing lurking in the bush. It appears to move in the direction of the camera before vanishing. It has long hair and is slender. Iggy Pop may be the culprit if it's not a legendary beast. What do you suppose this object is? As always, leave a comment below to share your thoughts on what was just seen. Having stated that, let's continue with the rest of the countdown. Mysterious Creature on a Trail GoPro cameras are frequently used by motorcycle riders who embark on excursions. An Indonesian Banda Ake motor trail community was riding motorcycles through the jungle, and everything seemed to be going according to plan. That is, until a motorcycle rider saw another rider who was lying on the track after noticing an odd thing in front of him. 
He was captured on the man's GoPro camera sprinting away in the distance. The thing fled into the tall grass as the biker gave up, and they all lost sight of it. It was carrying a staff that may have been a walking stick or a hunting spear, and it looked to be shorter than the usual human. Although many individuals have hypotheses about who or what it was, no one is absolutely certain. Some claim they might belong to one of the ethnic tribes in Aki, such as the Monte tribe. If you have a GoPro or similar camera, have you caught anything unusual, scary, or extraordinary on it? Tell us about it in the comments below. Also check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now. See you next time.